Yo, what is up guys? I'm bringing you a brand new video and this time I have for you today the method to gain up to 18 lightstones per hour. In this method you're going to get six of each kind nearly guaranteed per hour. There are some instances where you may get one or two less but those are pretty rare and the way that you do this is through farming the boss in the Ataraxian first dungeon over and over and over again. Every time you kill the boss, it drops one of each lightstone for all party members. You don't need to have your weekly available. You don't need to have any agris. You don't need anything other than just your four teammates, as well as it's recommended to have a shy in order to speed things up. But essentially, it involves going into the dungeon and farming 60 cold thorns. And then you're going to go to the second room and get six of the boss parts from the Kraten. After that, you then go into the next room and you get the bell and the scale. You need six of each of those. And then from there, you combine all of those into six boss keys and you enter the boss and you just kill it over and over and over again. And it's very important that when you're doing this method that you do combine all the items that you farmed. You need to make them into the daggers. If you don't make them into the daggers, they will remove all of the other hearts and scales and bells and materials that you farmed so you need to make sure that you're combining them into the six keys and the reason that you're going to want to have a shy for this method is we were actually able to kill the boss so quick in normal mode because we all had a lot of gear that we didn't even need to do the color phase so essentially you can just kill this boss all the way until it does the animation of the cutscene, and then you just kill the boss from there you enter into the rewards room you walk right past the altar if you don't have your daily and then from there you re-enter with all five keys and kill it again and it's going to take you roughly one hour in order to do the six kills and this is going to net you 180 million silver in keys as well as six of each type of lightstone with some varying degrees of potential to get two or instead of three i've seen sometimes where someone's even gotten one but the mass majority of the time, you're going to get three for every single party member, and that's going to net you 18 in an hour. Additionally, you can also consider doing the Elvia version of the dungeon. My teammates and I also did an hour of Elvia where we were able to farm four keys in order to do the Elvia version, and that means that we were able to get 200 mil in keys, 100 Kaffir stones, as well as 12 light stones in an hour. So it's actually pretty good. It's nearly 500 million silver in goods plus the light stones, which is actually pretty insane for not requiring any loot scroll or anything like that. However, you are going to be required to have some pretty decent gear as well as teammates and a shy. The shy is super important for this method. So yeah, I think this is a great method in order to get light stones. Even if you do the Elvia version, if you're farming in places like Star's End, Abandoned Monastery, Turos, you're making, in some cases, less than 500 million silver an hour, 200 million keys, 100 Kaffir stones, and you're getting maybe two, maybe three of a light stone that you want of one kind. Whereas in this method, you're going to be getting guaranteed four of each kind if you decide to do the Elvia version. Nearly guaranteed. There is a little bit of variance. And if you decide that you want to just straight up go straight for the light stones, then boom, you can do so in the normal version with only making 180 mil an hour as well as 18 lightstones. So that's pretty much it. I hope you guys found this method very useful. If you guys did, please drop a subscribe on the channel for more tips and tricks, and I will see you guys all in the next one. Peace.